Well, Antoinette, the teachers union and the school committee appear to be deadlocked here this morning. They remain millions of dollars apart in these negotiations. Late last night, teachers, the teachers union rallied after getting support from the head of the powerful National Education Association, the National Teachers Union. Both sides say the progress they've made is still not enough. The school committee and NTA are still about $15 million apart. Emotions are boiling over as students join calls to get back to school. Last night, the the school committee chair also broke down. My kids aren't going to school again. This has gone too far. We need our kids back in school. The mayor has the money. She doesn't need to make cuts from other departments. She doesn't need to make cuts from, from the schools. Um, she needs to provide the schools with the funding they need. The school committee says its same offer from Tuesday remains on the table. The proposal would increase salaries for all employees by a minimum of 12% over four years. Aides and behavioral therapists would see an increase of more than 15% over the course of the four year long contract. The teachers union has racked up over a half a million dollars in court ordered fines at this point. The head of the National Education Association stopped short yesterday of saying whether or not they would help the Newton Teachers Association pay those fines. We're live in Newton this morning. Jennifer Egan, WCVB News Center 5.